everybody. Today we're going to be talking about jobs, okay? And we're going to talk about how do we learn about jobs? So if, if you are interested in finding a new job or learning about jobs, what can you do to find more information, for example? First of all, you find from the internet. Okay, so you could look on the internet. Yeah. Morning. Okay, good morning. You can look on the internet. Yeah. Okay, what else can we do? Yeah, another thing is uh, uh, you ask the people, the friends. Yes, so Kaltoon said newspaper, mm -hmm. and Mohammed said you can Good, so that was going to be my next question. If you want to ask someone about their job, what kinds of questions can you ask? So Kaltoon said, maybe I would ask, um, are they hiring? Like your company, are they hiring, right? What other kinds of questions would I maybe ask if there, I wanted to learn? Yeah, is there any position you have a company? Are there any positions yeah. open at your company? Yeah. So, okay. when we want to start learning about jobs, we can search the internet, look in the newspaper, talk to friends, and maybe ask people in our own community. Right? Yeah. Morning, Uba. Okay. So, another way that we can learn about jobs is to talk to someone who has that job, okay? So, what's a job you, you have now or you might want to have in the future? Just any example. Like a uh, childcare. So maybe being a child care worker, right? So maybe right now, I'm, I'm not a child care worker. Yeah. <laughs> but maybe I want to become a child care worker so I could talk to someone, for example, who works at a, in child care, right? At yeah. a child care center. Yeah. And I would talk to that person about her job and I would ask questions, okay? And when we do this, when we talk to people about their jobs, okay, it's called an informational, right? Information or informational interview. Yeah, have you ever heard of uh, an interview? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so right, so before we start a job, we go to an interview, right? Yeah. And what happens at an interview? They ask questions. They ask you questions, right? Yes. And the the manager asks you questions why? Because they want to know your history. Or they want to know your history, right? They want to learn about you, yes. right? Or do you qualify? Are you qualified? Yes. Do you do you have experience? Yes. Do you have any skills, right? Do you have a certificate? Do you have a certificate? <laughs> a degree, a resume, yes. So they ask you all kinds of questions, right? Okay, so an informational interview is kind of flipped. It's kind of the other way. In an informational interview, I ask another person questions about their job. So if I wanted to be a child care worker, for example, I would talk, I would find someone who worked in that job, mm -hmm. and I would say, can I ask you some questions about your work? And I do this so I can learn more about the job, mm -hmm. because maybe I think I like it, but really, maybe there are things I would not like, right? Yeah. So one way restaurant manager. So I picked these, these jobs because some of these jobs you can learn about right at our program. For example, you can learn about child care worker 
at our program. Also, I think some, sometimes truck driver, and also re working in a restaurant, earning a certificate to be a manager, okay? Some of these are not in our program, but they are things I know sometimes students are interested in, working in healthcare, right? Dental assistant and pharmacy technician. Pharmacy, do you know what a pharmacy okay. technician is? So, I want you to decide which of these jobs you want to learn more about, okay? And then I want you to find a partner together two or three people who are going to learn about one of these jobs. Okay. Yeah, I know that. Yeah. We've got the criminal application. Now, we're going to think of a way that we can organize our ideas, okay? Okay. So, I'm going to give you this chart, okay? And this chart is called KWL chart okay so the K means what do I already know about this career okay maybe it's only a little bit and that's okay all right you're gonna write down what you know maybe you know where this person works what kind of a place or you know um, something about their job duties or something about the education they need okay you are going to write down, together with your partners, okay. one or two ideas about something you know about the, about the, yes, about what you have on the paper. And then you're going to think about, what do I want to learn more? What questions do I have? So the W is, what do I want to learn? What else do I want to know? about this job, okay? So you're gonna put something here and something here, okay? We're not gonna put anything here right now, okay? So, okay, so what, what do you know about about someone who might work in a pharmacy. What do you already know? Number one, was assistant of pharmacy. Okay, so you could, you, that's right, that's on your paper, so you could put that down. Um, a pharmacy technician? Yeah, assist a pharmacist. Right. You put what you know, and, 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 and it doesn't have to be a lot. Maybe you only know a couple of things, but you know that they, they help with fillings. Yeah, yeah. So that, yeah, you can put that down. Just ideas. What's something you know about what a truck driver might do? Delivery. Uh-huh, so they can deliver, for example, what do they deliver? Okay, so. Yeah, so for example, I work at a company, I need paper. Then the delivery driver delivers the paper I need or office supplies, right? Yeah. What about to people's houses? Do drivers ever bring things to people's houses? Yeah, like, like Federal Express or UPS, sometimes they bring um, like packages to people's houses maybe. Yeah. The K is what you know, the W is what you want to learn, and the L is what you already learned, what you did learn later. We'll do that last. How can, how can I? So I think what, so salary means how much do I take home? And I think this question is, 
Is there is there a way that I can find money, maybe from a grant or from the, the government, to help financially, to help me pay? Or your pocket? Or my pocket? Yeah. 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 This, this one's free now. Yes. This was free. College. Yeah. You have to money. Oh, that's right. So how, how can I find money? to pay for college or for training, yeah. Find money to pay for school. Should we say for school? Okay. So one question I might have is what kind of certificate do I need for this job, right? So their jobs were pharmacist, technician, and dental assistant, yeah? What's another one? Where, where can I learn school pharmacist or kids? Yeah, where can I go to school, right? And then I really like the question you asked about uh, how can you pay, right? That was a good one. Can you read that one, Kaltun? Which one? I think it was number your number five. five. Yeah, how can I find money to pay for this school? Yeah, that was a good one. Where can I find money to pay for this school? Because they were talking at this table, school, when you go to college, is very expensive, right? Yeah. Our program here is free, but when you go to college, it's not free, right? Yeah. And so, um, yeah, can you find, but can you find financial aid or scholarship or grant to help you pay for the certificate? Yes, very good. We're going to put these over here. So you asked about, you asked about an internship, right? Yeah, where's, how long? Where's your internship question? Uh, yeah. yeah, can you read that one? How long does our internship? How long does it take? The yeah. Internship. Yeah. yeah, so do you know what an internship is? Yeah, yes. yeah what is it? Well, I don't know, you have to tell me. <laughs> it's for training, right? It's on the job training. It's where I go and work for a company and I do it maybe for little money or no money to get experience, right? And then if I do a good job, hopefully that company would hire me to be a worker, right? Yeah. These are questions we could ask someone for our interview, our informational interview. Okay? But also there are other ways we could find out answers to these questions, right? We could do a little bit of research, right? Yeah, what does research mean? To find how to find how to something else. find some answers at the library, some on the internet, and then maybe some I talk to people, and that's also research, talking and asking questions. Yes, I found for you some research. I found for you some information about your job, okay? So these are stories, they're called career stories, and they are, they're, it's a story written by someone who has a job and they tell what they like or what they don't like about their job. They talk about what kind of school they need, what they like, what can be difficult about their job, okay? So I'm going to give you uh, one of these that goes along with the, with the information on your smaller sheet, okay? So over here I have pharmacy. You can talk about your story with a partner, and then you're going to put down a, one or two or three things that you learn on your L, okay? Oh, so that's something you didn't know that it only takes two years? Yes. And so it's a quick it's a quick way to get started. But you remember, yeah, you're not a dentist, you're a helper. But then once you helping a helper is good too. And then once you get experience, yes, then you could be it could be more and more and more, right?
best or worst? Yeah, so it talks about the best and worst, yeah. worst parts of the job, right? Yeah. Yeah. What did she, what did this person think was the best part of the job? Best part of the job, learn how much to take a pharmacy, you can gain a lot of knowledge. So, yes, you, the best side. you learn from other workers, right? Yes. From your co-workers, yes, yeah. uh-huh. Other way for the opposite side. Yeah. Okay, that's what we should have fun to deal with occasional food or guests. Yeah, so you have to work with a rude guest, right? Yeah, Someone sometimes. who's maybe not happy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so that might be a bad part, right? Oh, okay, so you didn't know that sometimes washing dishes would be part of that job? Yeah. Do you think washing dishes would be something you'd like or not like? <laughs> you would not like? <laughs> You know the How come the wash yeah, but what if you're the manager and then one of your dishwasher calls and says, I'm yeah. sick, I can't come in. Yeah. So, you have to, so maybe you would have to help out. Okay. Usually a manager has to learn every single job in the restaurant. How to be the dishwasher, how to be the table cleaner, how to be the order taker, how to be the cook. Cooking. <laughs> and, and also how to watch people, right? But if, if someone from your staff calls in sick maybe it's your job to you have to jump in and help right you have to fill the position and even if that's a position you don't like like washing dishes <laughs> yeah Mohammed, do you have something that you learned that you didn't know yeah okay just to, first of all i just started for the job of tips you oh so you were interested in the job tips uh-huh how to find place of employment you can have the big technical classes. So you have to take you only need ten classes or take tech classes? Tech classes. Take for, tech classes. Okay. And employment is they pay for the classes. Oh and oh I know. So it's saying some places where you work, yeah. you should look for a workplace that will pay for your classes. Yeah. Right, right. That's the for the for that's for the occasion when So there, there are things that you learned, and some of those are, hey, this is great. Other stuff is, uh, maybe I wouldn't like to do this about this job, or I don't like this idea, right? Um, things that I, things that I would not, or things that I don't think I would like, right? This is kind of not for me. Okay, maybe you decided you were excited, pharmacy technician, woohoo, and then, oh, I don't want to do this. Okay, right? Um, Things I would still have to learn, things I would have to learn to do this. Right. And then lastly, things I already have experience with. So maybe you discovered that, hey, I'm almost halfway there, or I, I, I know. I don't have these two questions, or they're not really questions, but these two areas are really kind of similar to the modals that we've been talking about. The last minds. Okay? Yeah. It's kind of advice. It's, here it's not really advice, but no. here we've got the modal would. Okay? Like. So we're talking about what we would like. Okay, it, it, we're kind of imagining if you had this job. Okay, we're using our imagination. If we had this job, I would like this. Okay, if I had this job, I wouldn't like this. Okay, we don't have the job today, but if we're kind of imagining, right? We're, we're kind of imagining. So just think about those two things and write some ideas. What would you like? What wouldn't you like? About restaurant managers. So these are the positive things, right? We got two restaurant managers. No, yeah. I don't want two. Two? Yeah. Maria? Uh, meet new people. Okay, meet new people. Okay, I would like, okay, meet new people. Okay, that's good. Okay, how about pharmacy technician? Yes. Oh, okay. I love him. Uh, uh, very popular. I think very popular among you guys. Yeah. Pharmacy technician. Okay, what would you like about it? Yeah, I like, I like, um, to work the pharmacy and medicine. Okay. You want to work with medicine. Medicine. Okay. Okay. Ask more specific questions. So hopefully after today, right, you've got some questions already of things I have to learn. Some of these questions and some of the other questions that you made, you could ask, you know, those questions to him, because now you've got more specific things you want to know, right? So that might be helpful.